I think the biggest challenge our customer our customers are facing and HPE's customers are facing too is how are they going to become uh, these true digital natives? How are they going to actually embrace technology in a way that allows them to become these fast, effective, secure, new generation enterprises? And I think you know, hiding inside that 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 question is for me. There's this real gap of confidence where you know we've built some of these largest organizations in the world. They're the most complicated organizations in the world. They they're they're in many cases core to the fabric of our lives. And yet, when when I talk to customers about their experiences or about their technology, you know, often it starts with an apology. You know, they'll say to me, "Oh, I'm so sorry that we're talking because my infrastructure or my 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 place is is garbage." Um, and and you know, they're holding up in contrast, uh, you know, the the Facebooks or the Googles or the or the whatevers of the world. And I think the the truth is that they're not garbage, right? The, in fact, it is this really complicated. Thing that we've created that is so so interesting and so valuable, but but what we haven't done is really made that transition to believing that at our core we're all technology companies, right? That that technology isn't isn't a thing that we use to accomplish our business. It is in fact the core of what the business is, and we use that technology then to do something in the world. You know, we're a technology company that are an insurance broker. We're a technology company that that is a bank or that we're a technology company that does retail or that does oil and gas or whatever it is, but it's it's technology company first and then it's whatever we produce with technology second. And I think, you know, that challenge manifests itself in a bunch of different ways. And sometimes it's technological where we we make technical decisions that we believe we can't change because uh, because of the business or because of the constraints we have. Uh, and then there's a competitor who shows up who who doesn't feel that way, and then all of a sudden they solve it in a way you don't understand. You have to catch up. Um, sometimes it's it's just pure culture. Um, and I think for us, the products we build uh, are automation products that help people understand how to build more facile, more nimble organizations.